Assalamu alaikum, Pips Tech Utopia here. So I'm gonna do full review of this mini Bluetooth keyboard, RiK12. You can buy it on our site, gearbuzz.com. So enjoy this full review and buy it with my promo link. Beautiful mini keyboard with the back, which is made from steel. So yeah, enjoy. So yep, here we are, Pips. So we're gonna do the unboxing, like I uh, already said in this intro. So let's begin, of course. Uh, it's right now on the flash sale. It's not even $20. The regular price is around $24, $25. This is an epic keyboard, Pips. Let's go. Here we go. Anyway. Uh, nothing, there's no any specs uh, outside of the box, uh, just the logos and everything. It looks, the packaging looks really nice. It doesn't look cheap at all, man. So let's take it all out. Okay, so there you go. We have here the K12 Plus multifunction slim mini wireless keyboard user manual. We have here some greeting thank you card for purchasing the uh, Re products. Nice, nice of them. We have the keyboard inside, of course, and let's see what do we have more. We have the cable, micro USB cable for charging your device. Believe it or not, you have also an OTG cable here all, all together connected. This is insane. Thank you. Thank you, Re, and thank you, GearBest. So, there you go, Pips. One cable. Anyway, let's put everything on the back. I'm just put it like that. Anyway, we're gonna just leave the keyboard yet there. And let's see what do we have in the manual there. So let's see here. Overview. That's a long manual, man. Damn. Okay, package contains wireless keyboard, like I said, USB wireless receiver. I'll go, I'm gonna show you that when I'm gonna when I'm gonna show you how to connect it. It connect it. So multimedia key description. You do have here a lot of tutorials and instructions, combination keys. Uh, just stop, pause the video there if you are interested. Okay, USB charging cable for receiver for charging, which is also great, man. So anyway, there you go. So. Current uh, charging current is 300 milliamps. There, sleeping current uh, is like 86. Operating vo operation voltage 3.3. Product weight 210 gram, of course. And product size is mini. You will see later on, but it's not that, that mini, mini, mini. Anyway, installation is, are there, but I will show you that in a minute. So, out of sleep and wake up future. Just pause the video so you can see everything. If you are interested in the full specs, pips, I want to do a really uh, quick reviews, uh, just to go straight away to the main job for you. So just pause the video if you are interested in the whole manual, because of, your, of course you can't check it uh, on Gearbest site. So let's go now to this keyboard. Yeah, I love it, man. It's really premium looking. T Keyboard, premium looking feeling, premium looking and premium feeling also. The back is made from steel, from metal, some kind of metal. It's not plastic for sure. Just beautiful. Anyway, see it again by yourself. A lot, a lot of, uh, of, of buttons here for you. And keys, like you see here, so many of them, man. And what is also cool about, uh, cool about this keyboard that it has, uh, Touchpad that there in sanity on the right side you even have a touchpad for $20 right now on the flash sale This is insanity. So go and purchase it pips My my really honest advice for you. I just love this keyboard Anyway, let me just show you where is the dongle the receiver So just basically here I'm gonna take it out because we're gonna just need it in a minute So this is a black color with some uh, with some silver finishing or something like that. But anyway, the buttons are here. So on off is here. So it's an off and a USB charger here. Micro USB a charging port and of course to charge your tablet. Like I said, 300 milliamp hours battery. So it depends. Uh, anyway, it has also a future. If you do not touch a, a, a key for three minutes, it's gonna turn off, uh, out, go in auto sleep by itself, which is really good. That's a cool future. So that's enough of the keyboard. Uh, later on, when I'm gonna connect it, we're gonna talk a little bit. So for the testing purposes, I'm gonna use a dual OS tablet. So we're gonna test it on Windows and Android side there. 
So let's go now first test it on Android, shall we? So dongle goes in the micro USB OTG adapter. I'm just using my own. I'm not going to use uh, there because this one has the type C. Anyway, just a minute. Type C, it has a type C USB port uh, while while uh, the one that they provided is just for the micro micro USB uh, ports. So uh, after that, just turn the keyboard on. Okay, keyboard is on. Just a moment, focus. Come on, don't do me that. Okay, okay, I can see it by itself. Anyway, so you could see this LED that it's uh, constantly on. It shouldn't flash. If is it flashing, probably the connection with the dongle, it's not uh, connected there. So, here we are. I have to say that touchpad is insanely good and sensitive. Sensitivity just for my taste, man. Seriously, just beautiful. Beautiful. So you drag it. You do have here option uh, where it, where are the shift? Where is the shift? Left click and right click. So it's really good. Like you see here, you can do a lot of things even in Android side of this tablet. So dragging, simple like that. Insane, man. Insane. Anyway, let's go to the Chrome here. And try to Google something. Your best. Enter. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go to yes. Okay. Nice, man. Just nice. Okay. So we have, what do we have here more? A lot of options, a lot of keys there, no doubt delete down there so you're gonna have to combine uh, two different uh, two different uh, keys there to example to have f12 or the or example where the f12 you do have here minimum or where is the insert you have maximum sound there okay so right now the sound is there f12 is down there so you have to hold all the buttons to do the f12 so there is good the f12 is that and voila so you have to hold the left button there, the left button of the mouse and click the F12. Simple like that. Of course, it's going to give you straight away all together there. But this is Android. We will have to test it in the Windows to see it completely. So far, it's really nice even in Android. I have to say again, go YouTube. YouTube, enter. So yeah, uh, I do have large hands, so I have to say that 100% it's not that good for me because my hands are extremely large. I'm almost two meters uh, big man, so you know, proportionally to my fingers, they're also really long, but so I do not have average, uh, average fingers. But this keyboard is for average people. Uh, don't, uh, don't, uh, don't be in panic or something like that. You can use this keyboard and I'm going to use it from now on in my bed. You can because you don't have to move anywhere uh, if you are too lazy or after work, if you are too tired or something like that. OK, let's see here. Zipper merge. What the hell? What kind of video they suggested me? How to zipper merge? I don't know. I don't know. What is this? So we have here options. Click left to save the video. Click right. Okay, again, escape. Okay, we can't escape here because it's different. But anyway, let's go now to the Windows side. So please make sure to... I'm going to just close everything. Yep, it's really smooth and responsive. I love the feeling of the touchpad. It's really premium looking, man. Also, the the sound and the quality of the keys is really good. I have to say they are really sturdy. This keyboard is sturdy, pips. This is a premium looking and feeling a keyboard. Like I said, it is, it is for its money. It's premium, man. It's premium. So yeah, let's go now. Stay tuned. Please make sure to stay tuned because I'm going to boot to Windows and test a little bit this keyboard on the Windows operative system. Okay, gents and ladies. So here we are in Windows 10. So basically here we uh, we here we are you just uh, plug it and play it simple like that you do not have to wait to install some drivers with these dongles it just uh, 
put the dongle in the OTG adapter and that's it, you're ready, it works fine, you do not have to wait minutes or, or hours or something like that, in a second or two it's ready. So, let's see here, so two button, two, uh, two, two touches with two fingers work as a right touch, so you just touch it like that and there you go, or you can just simply use this one which is on the, on the bottom here, so you use this one quickly, tap two times, or use this one for the right click. So two times right click or the one like that. So dragging like that you need to use of course this button here which is good. This is I love this position because it will be really inconvenient to have it here. You will be uh, far away from the keys, really really far away. So if you are here and most of the or most of the letters are starting of course you do know with the A, S, E and etc and etc. Anyway, it's really convenient there. Anyway, let's go straight away here. Let's open, let's just open some new, some file here, some text document. Okay, text document for us. I'm going to just put it this on full screen here. Okay, so here we are. Tech Utopia. Hope you find. Okay, we. Why I'm not writing in that? Okay, I'll just go like enter. Okay, so like you see here, like, share, YouTube. Yep, works really nice there. Hoo, 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 hoo. Arrow is also nice. Yep, F12. Okay, you don't see there, but it's uh, in the Windows. Then also these buttons down there work exactly how would they work on your laptop or desktop. Tab there, we do have tab. Obviously, you can see it there. Caps lock works nice. Okay, here you go, caps lock, caps lock off, caps lock on, shift, works nice, all the buttons work nice, oop, what I done here, what, I don't know what is that, but hey ho, so yeah, Anyway, uh, probably maybe later on if I find time, I'm gonna also test uh, more of these keys and everything pips out, so this is a quick review for you. I enjoy it, I love it, and I'm gonna use it. From now on, I'm gonna use this beautiful Re K12 keyboard, man. Just beautiful, it's trans transportable, maybe for some of you it's not big enough, but uh, it's transportable, pips, you can get it to your work, to your, I don't know, whatever you want, you can get it in your small bag, it's not that big. So, this tablet is 11 inches, above 11 inches, and like you see here, this is perfect for this tablet, I have to say. For this tablet, this is perfect. Beautiful side, almost the same length as my tablet, and voila. So yeah, I hope you find this video helpful to you. Uh, I hope you're gonna buy it if you're already considering. Please make sure to use my promo link, which is under this video. Like always, it will help me to do more reviews for you. So yeah, K12 REE. -E. That's it. That's it. Mahsalama, peace.